The Acolyte Star Wars trailer just dropped today, and there wasn't much in there, but it was enough to unpack that I wanted to make a short video on it. So obviously a little bit of information before we start the trailer. The show starts in the High Republic era of Star Wars, which is basically when the Jedi rose to power, and it's kind of a more peaceful time period, or it was until the events here are taking place. The trailer starts off with a bunch of younglings sitting in a room, kind of meditating, and they are with their master, who is obviously one of the main characters of the show. And he's telling them, he's giving them some good advice. He's saying, close your eyes. Don't let your eyes deceive you. We cannot trust them. And then he asks them, what do you see? During this part, the scene kind of goes back and forth between our main character and then back to the younglings. Specifically when he's saying, don't trust them, it kind of pans over to the main character. So we can all assume that she's kind of a gray Jedi, but we'll unpack a little bit of that later. One of the younglings says, I see light. One of them says, balance. And then a third one says, I see fire. After that, the camera switches back to a different scene and it's the main character, the female, and she's just going rogue with a knife. We kind of see her in some other scenes again. There's Jedi in a room, kind of in a cavern looking type place, and she shows up with a knife and it says, someone's killing Jedi. So we can only assume it's probably her. Once again, one of the main characters is saying, what did you see, what happened? And this guy says, I sense the darkness. And we get another switch back to a scene with the main character with a knife once again but this time she's fighting the main Jedi from the very beginning of the trailer. Another character says, this isn't about light and dark, this is about power. Obviously it's referring to the fact that someone's trying to gain power, it's not just good and bad. Everyone thinks they're good in these situations, but this is about power. Fast forwarding a little bit to the end of the trailer, there's a bunch of Jedi standing around in the woods it looks like, and they say, what is that? All of a sudden a red lightsaber flies through, breaks up down a bunch of trees, ends up in somebody's hands and we do not know who this character is yet but then all of a sudden the jedi ignite their lightsabers and are all pushed back at the same time with the force we can only assume it's one sith there there's only one lightsaber and there was like eight jedi and that's really it for the trailer it just ends right there we don't know who the last character is we don't know what's up with the jedi who they're fighting at this point but the trailer ends there so now I kind of want to give my honest thoughts on the trailer. Overall, I thought it looks pretty good. I don't understand why the main antagonist, I thought she was a Jedi of some sort, um, especially because she does use the force a little bit to keep herself from getting pushed down to the ground um, when the Jedi is pushing her back with force push. She kind of holds her ground there, so you can tell she has a little bit of um, force powers. She's also wearing purple, which I know Leslie Headland said something about um, the fact that red and blue kind of mix together make purple. We see that with Mace Windu too, but it kind of shows a, si shows a sign of being in the middle in a sense and not being, you know, completely pulled to one side light or dark, just being somewhere in the middle. But overall, I will say, I really don't want to see a lot of fighting with a knife. I just think, you know, in a world full of lightsabers, seeing knives is just not that exciting. That's just my honest opinion on that though. And I, I don't know what you guys think, but just for me, it's not very exciting at all to see a knife being pulled out against a lightsaber in a in lightsaber combat. I just don't really find that exciting. I think the main character will be really cool. I just want to, you know, learn more and hear more about her. Overall, though, I think the trailer was pretty cool. I think that this time period is really cool um, in general, just with the high, being in the High Republic and the Jedi are kind of at full power and they don't really suspect anything is going to happen. And then all of a sudden some darkness comes in and now we don't really know what's going to happen at this point. Keep in mind, this also takes place around 100 years before the Phantom Menace. So obviously this is going to go into the power of you know, how does Emperor Palpatine kind of take over? How did the Sith even really like come about? And we're gonna see a lot of, you know, probably really cool um, events take place in the timeline here that lead up to the Phantom Menace. I think the characters are pretty cool so far. I think uh, obviously there's a lot of Jedi. I think it's gonna be really cool to see that. I think there's gonna be cool to see, you know, some Sith as well. I'm really excited to figure out who that Sith was at the end of the trailer. I wanna know if it's somebody that we actually know, or, you know, maybe it's someone that uh, they created for the show specifically, but Obviously, they're very powerful. I mean, they just took on like seven or eight Jedi at the very end, and they seem very confident as well. I mean, flying through with their lightsaber, just flying through the woods, and they're just force pushing all the Jedi at the same time. That's pretty much it. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I think the trailer was pretty cool overall. I'm just excited to see more. And one final thought on this is the episodes need to be longer. We need like 40 minute minimum episodes because I can't do it with these 20 minute episodes. You know, you're waiting a whole week and then you get a 20 minute episode. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about the trailer. I'm actually pretty excited for it. You know, I was curious going into it, what it was going to be like, but the trailer does it justice so far. And I'm pretty, pretty excited to see what happens here. Also, I would love to hear what you guys think about the, the knife combat, you know, against lightsabers and stuff, what that is and where maybe the main character even 
sits in place with all this, what her role is. Let me know what you guys think. See you in the next one. Have a good day. May the force be with you.